said that old age is a pretty sad stage. Our grandpa loves having fun and arranging pranks on his grandkids. Dropping dentures, faking fake heart attacks, feeding his grandkids with slime, and breaking laptops? Watch funny grandpa pranks in our new video. Our grandpa is young at heart. He has been playing Warcraft for three hours now. But as soon as his grandkids come by, grandpa immediately turns into an old sick person. He strikes the most dramatic pose. Ben and Christy come to visit Grandpa. You are just in time. They will manage to save their favorite elderly relative. Ben gives him a heart massage. Ha ha, got you! Grandpa's a prankster. Grandpa wants to get up and ask the kids to give him a hand. And he has already snuck in a slime prank. Ben is so gullible. He helps Grandpa and falls for his octogenarian slime. Ah, young people are so different nowadays. They are so trustful. And Grandpa still has a ton of surprises coming. Grandpa is happy to treat the grandkids to candies. Enjoy, kids! Coat hard candies with mustard powder and cover them with the wrappers. Grandpa didn't warn the kids that his candies taste like mustard. Oh, it burns! Christy and Ben need to rinse their mouths with water, and the extra minute of laughter made Grandpa's life longer. Ben wants to relax and drink some tea in peace. But his kind Grandpa is already here. He coughs right near the tea, and his dentures fall straight into Ben's cup. Ew! That's disgusting! Add half an ounce of gelatin to one glass of milk and a teaspoon of powdered sugar. Thoroughly mix it until the gelatin completely dissolves. Use a pipette to pour the mixture into the teeth of a silicone denture mold. Let it harden. Add pink food coloring to the remaining jelly mixture. And pour it into the rest of the mold. Let it refrigerate. Take the ready denture out of the mold. Grandpa doesn't think that the lost denture is embarrassing. He catches it and eats the fake teeth as if nothing happened. Ugh! It turns out to be an edible prank. Our grandpa is such a magician. Grandpa knows his way around technology and came up with a new prank. He asks Ben to help him with the laptop because it's broken. The progressive grandson should take a look at it. Ben starts helping Grandpa. He takes the laptop apart. And meanwhile, Grandpa sneaks in some extra details. Ben put everything together and fixed it. Now Grandpa can keep on surfing dating sites. That's great, but where did all these extra details on the table come from? It seems like his IT grandson forgot to put them back. Come on, solve this problem, grandson. And meanwhile, Grandpa will laugh at his prank. Ben is working on a report about UFOs. Don't distract him. He's so serious about his work, but it doesn't stop Grandpa. He already sneaks in for the next prank. He distracts Ben and changes his mouse for a soap version. Secure a computer mouse mold to keep it in place. Melt clear soap base in a microwave. Add orange soap coloring. Mix it. Use a pipette to fill the scroll wheel. Let it harden. For the next layer, mix clear soap base and red coloring. Fill in the next details. Remove the excess with a toothpick. Cover the buttons and the body of the mouse using white soap base with a drop of black food coloring. Clean the edges. Scrape the top layer when the soap hardens. Melt white soap base. Add water-soluble grapeseed oil and a few drops of black coloring. Sprinkle the mold with rubbing alcohol and pour in the top layer of soap. Let it harden. Take out the ready soap mouse. Then take the mouse 
but it slips out of his hands as if it's alive. It's so slippery. And his palms are all covered in soap bubbles. Now I see. It's another prank from Grandpa. Grandpa loves making people work. The best thing in the world is watching somebody else work. Grandpa asks his treasured grandkids to help him move a heavy dresser. To the left, more to the left, and now to the right. No, the other way. You don't understand anything, my silly grandkids. Ben and Christy are tired and sweaty. They keep moving the dresser left and right without a rest. When will our grandpa calm down? Maybe he should put his glasses on. At last, we are done with the dresser. We just have to hang a picture. Grandpa tortures his grandkids again. He's not satisfied with the place. Then he finally picks it up. Now we have to install a nail. Grandpa gladly hands over some tools. Make little balls out of polymer clay. Press half of the balls with a pencil making flat heads of nails. Scrape the signature pattern on them. Roll the other half of the balls to make nail shanks. Trim the tips to make them sharp. Bake the nails following the clay instructions. Super glue the heads to the shanks and coat them with metallic acrylic paint. Cut a box layout from cardboard. Glue and sign it. Put in the clay nails. Ben hammers in a nail, but it breaks right in his hands. Maybe Ben turned into Superman. Let's try one more. You can try all of them, but you won't knock in any nails because they are from Grandpa. Ben figures out the prank. He can easily crush a nail with one hand. What is that thing crawling on the floor? Is this a bill on a string? It's the oldest prank ever. It's as old as our grandpa. But the kids respect their elders. That's why they decide to go along with grandpa's prank. Let him have some joy in his old age. Grandpa lures the kids to the kitchen. And he is very satisfied with his classic prank. But most importantly, the bill is safe and sound. Grandpa has prepared a sweet snack. He brews some calming green tea for his grandkids. Take the green tea leaves out of bags. Chop fresh parsley. Put it on parchment paper and dry it in an oven at 180 degrees Fahrenheit. Finally crumble the dried parsley and put it into the tea bags. Sew the bags and attach the labels back. Put them into a box. The kids are happy to be taken care of by their grandpa. Christy tastes the tea. It doesn't smell like care at all. It smells like parsley. Ew, that's gross. And grandpa laughs at his grandkids. This tea is nice. It's healthy. Grandpa wants to make up for what he did and treats the kids to his signature pie. Bon appetit. Cover a pie pan with light clay. Roll out light clay and cut it into strips. Make clay decor the same way using cookie cutters. Let all the clay pieces harden. Coat them with acrylic paint so that they look like pastry. Use a sponge with a darker shade to make a golden pie crust. For the filling, put broken pink eyeshadow into white glue. Add raspberry fragrance oil. Stir the pink mixture. Pour in contact lens solution and add baking soda. Mix a soft pink slime. Put it onto the base of the pie. Make a pattern out of the clay strips on top and add decor around the perimeter. The pie looks normal. Is Grandpa actually done pranking us? But once the kids are going to taste the pie, everything becomes obvious. It's not a real dessert, and there is slime instead of a filling. It's gross and slippery, just like Grandpa. This pie isn't edible. Maybe whipped cream can help. Grandpa always has new surprises for his grandkids. 
Grandpa is a die-hard music fan. He puts in wireless headphones and turns on some hard rock music. It's intense, just like his life. Grandpa's dance looks more like a stroke. Be careful, Grandpa! Cut earbuds off old ear pods. Clean them with rubbing alcohol and put them into an air pod box. Grandpa sings along very loudly. But once Ben takes a headphone, music disappears. Maybe you need a special hearing aid for these headphones. Are Grandpa's headphones broken? Or is it just another prank? With relatives like these, you'll never be bored. Ben is playing on his phone. But some noise from the kitchen distracts him. Just in time! Because Grandpa already sneaks up with a new prank. He pours paint onto his grandson's phone. Add borax to stationary glue. Knead a soft slime. And put in colorful light clay. Thoroughly knead the slime. Attach a printed out label to a little can. Add the color on the lid and put in the slime. Let's color the phone with new paints. Ben comes back and sees the tragedy. He quickly removes the paint from his phone. Thank goodness it's just slime. Otherwise, Grandpa would have to buy a new phone with his retirement fund. Did you like our Grandpa pranks? Then write in the comments if you would like to have such a funny relative. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel and click the bell so that you don't miss our funny pranks on Troom Troom.